Is this how you treat people's property while you're doing the rounds? Unbelievable. Guest privacy is our utmost concern. We operate in accordance with the city's laws. We would never interfere with a guest's belongings without permission. Huh? They're fighting! <laughs> Oh, you guys are still here. What's wrong? It's none of your business. Oh my god, everyone is so uncooperative. Yeah, whatever. It appears someone ransacked Keith Tozaki's room. Uh huh. He thinks we're responsible. Supervisor Sion, please prove that this has nothing to do with us. <gasps> do you have a mission for me? Um. Jeez! How? You gotta prove the betas are innocent! This is a big deal! Why? Um, yeah, if there was a problem. Knock knock! What? We'd like to check the state your room was left in. Can we come in? We're gonna prove the betas are innocent! <clears throat> <laughs> what? It's so clean. A wheel luggage. Look at all this weird stuff. <laughs> Do you mind if we take a look around? Doesn't look like I have much of a choice. Go on. That could be a nice research. What's this? Matryoshka. Well, you know, this Russian doll. I think that's how it's called. Looks like it came with the room. You seen one of those before? I don't think so. Huh. It really is a wheel. <laughs> Can you ride this thing? Yeah, pretty handy for short trips. Oh, is it like a one wheel segue, was it? You're flying, Lily. <laughs> well, he's a tea lover. Oh. This is the same teapot Keith was using down in the lounge. Hey, that belongs to me, champ. Look at all these tins. It must be a real pain lugging all this tea around. Look at all these tins. It must be <laughs> a real pain. I'm guessing this cup comes with the room. Oh. Mm. It's locked. I don't think we'll be able to take a look at what's on here. Are you sure? December 17th, 5 p.m. local time. A blog. I went to visit Albert this morning, but he'd been killed. <laughs> I saw someone flee the scene. I took after them, but lost them near the Institute. I'm pretty sure they weren't ordinary. They might have been one of the old guy's subjects. Or should I say, victims. <sighs> For the longest time, Albert was the biggest protector of variants in the world. That's why I left the kid here in the city. What happened to Albert in the last nine years that made him change? Well, it's a long time, to be sure. Not that there's any use getting caught up in the past. 
I figured if news of the old guy's death leaked out, the other cities would get even more wary. I tried hiding the body in the underground lab, but my cover-up didn't go to plan. You are busted. Well, nothing we didn't know of. What the hell? Is this some kind of case? No, that's a part of a gun. <laughs> that broken EMP weapon in the staff room had the same logo as this. Right. Maybe the gun belongs to Keith? Suspicious. Keith, what's this case for? Oh, that thing? Hmm. Let me see. Don't you lie to me. He isn't playing ball. I should make a quick note before he decides to hide it somewhere. <laughs> so then Ash would steal it? A <laughs> baton. What's this? It looks like glass, but it's actually made of metal. Is it... Give me a break. That thing is strictly for self-defense. Yeah, sure. Naughty, naughty. <laughs> I think that's all. I didn't touch this. It's wide open. Looks like someone has been messing with the contents, too. Didn't you think to lock the trunk before you left the room? <laughs> of course I did. Hmm. It doesn't look like the lock was forced, though. It's an antique. Getting one of these open used to be a real trade secret. But these days, the info is out there if you know where to look. So somebody could open it even if they don't have the key. I guess I was too careless. It never occurred to me that someone here in the city might know how to unlock it. You better take a good look at the top of the trunk, champ. Huh. <sighs> You mean the thing? What's this? <laughs> Traveling stickers. Okay. That's it, really. So. Who went and messed with my stuff? I guess we can blame it on Ash. Weird that they didn't really take all that much, though. Can you tell me what was missing from the room? Well, we know, so... A few things from the trunk. I think that's about it. Can you be more specific? No can do, champ. You... <sighs> If you don't tell me, I won't be able to help you get your belongings back. Whatever. None of the stuff that got stolen means a whole lot to me anyway. <sighs> Do you have any idea why someone would ransack the room? Was there anything valuable inside? Nah, I don't own anything a thief would target. Even the stuff that went missing isn't worth all that much. Seems like he's done talking. Wait, I just saw those photos. Warning! Yeah! I've got a few questions for you, if you don't mind. Of course. Ask away. Oh. Drone interrogation. Was this room actually ransacked? Is the state it's in now different from how you left it? Affirmative. When we left it go to the lounge, the trunk was shut. Oh, yeah, because it was before. The service drone entered his room while Keith was away, right? I can totally understand why he'd come to the conclusion he did. Under no circumstances would we ever ransack a guest's room.
I heard you've been with Keith ever since he got back to the hotel. I sure have. I've been keeping him under surveillance the whole time. Can you tell me what he's been up to since arriving at the hotel? Keith Tozaki left the bureau at 8 o'clock and headed straight for his room. He was asleep until 9.05 o'clock when the room was due to be cleaned. That's when he went downstairs to the lounge. And you haven't let him out of your sight? Negative. I've been observing him constantly. Keith Tozaki could not have committed the crime. Okay, Jesus. I see. Well, that corroborates what Keith was saying. I should make a note of the drone's responses. Who's lying here? I think we've pretty much seen everything we need to see. <laughs> For sure. If I combine the info I found, I should be able to prove the betas are innocent. I knew I could count on you, mister! Come on, give it a try! <laughs> ah. Where to next? Oh, we have more. I think I get it. It's so much stuff that is like obvious, but I guess. Where to next? For the purposes of the game, it's just <laughs> refreshing. I see. I guess this is also like pre judgment room. Did you get everything straightened out? Yeah. Thanks, Lily. Right. Now it's time to try and convince Keith with what I just figured out. Keith, hear me out. What's up, champ? An EMP weapon got stolen from your room, right? There's a faulty <laughs> drone in the staff room on this floor. We found an EMP weapon with an empty battery lying next to it. Whoever took the gun wanted to disable that drone. Hmm. <sighs> with me so far? My theory is that whoever disabled the drone is the same person that went through your stuff. The beta keeping an eye on you couldn't have been responsible. I hate to admit it, but I guess you're right. This guy's squeaky clean. Of course Hal's right, mister! Look, I thought you two were supposed to be trying to solve the actual case. What are you doing wasting your time on this? Get back to the task at hand, champ. <laughs> well, I agree. <laughs> Thank you, Keeper Zeta. We're so proud of you. Well, hmm. you sit on something. I was worried we were getting sidetracked, but that actually had some bearing on the case. <laughs> 